Morning guys. Uh, just out here in the turkey woods doing the old spur road shuffle trying to find a gobbler or two. Um, hey, just wanted to remind you guys, we're doing the spring fever giveaway. We've got a ton of gear. We've got a SIG Spectre pistol. It's new to the market. Never been out. You guys could win that. It's in a 9mm. Um, SIG binoculars, image stabilizers, the Zulu 6s, rangefinder, Hanwag boots, Onyx lifetime membership, mountain house, first light, tons of stuff. So anyways, we're doing that spring giveaway. Uh, if you jump over to the website for every dollar spent an entry and uh, it's just our way to give back for all the support and uh, greatly appreciate it. So, so this week ends on May 2nd. So get in there while you can. Dude, that is a monster beard. The strut series is in full effect, brother. <coughs> oh, good morning. Woke myself up at like two in the morning with a coughing fit. I think I coughed for like 45 minutes straight. It was ridiculous last night. Ah, uh, T-Rev, you ready to go kill Longbeard today? He's yeah. down for anything. So, uh, I think Trev and I are going to take off. Strand, you're taking Steve? Yep. Strand and Steve, and uh, Trent and Troy are the three teams. So, uh, they're, they're in the swing shift mode right yeah. now. Trent's Troy, still... I heard last night, Troy got put in charge of waking up, and we both know how that goes. Trent did that on purpose. Yeah. He's like, like a 5, 545 wake up. Yeah, right. Strategy. I forgot my uh, puffy coat, so I have a hoodie on. <laughs> hey. And then, yeah. I, I got it, an extra one. It's where we're doing it today. I got an extra one. You do? Yeah. I mean, this is the Rockies, right? Um, so anyways, yeah, we're going to split up, divide and conquer, three teams. Trent has something about points today, about an in, a point per inch of beer, a point per shed and if you kill a bear you're an automatic winner well pretty much going to win all three of those today so what if you see a bear you oh. automatically just win. wow looks like i'm driving a wildlife safari see you guys heard him yet, but we're getting there. We're getting there. You ready to slay, Steve? Oh, yeah. Right in the face. <laughs> Steve, you could get good money for that in an antique shop. Dude, this is... This is circa 1990. 93. <laughs> Back when I used to chase these freaking things. That is OG. OG. So, um, I haven't turkey hunted in a long time. 
and there's roads around, so my guess is oh, we can hike up through there. I think we can drive. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like where his head's at. <laughs> the road's right up there. Yeah. He's got to be, what, three, four hundred yards? More? He's right up in that saddle. He's literally right by the road. Yeah, he's right by the road. What do you think? Do we go freaking ninja cross country? <laughs> Send one of these three and a halves. I might myself if I walk up the hill. Yeah, stuff's gonna get moving in the system. I'm walking up that. That's him, though, I bet. That would be him. It's gotta be him. Same area. Yeah, because he was right up in here. All I can think is maybe he pitched out. Oh, down that way. He you might know what I mean? This way. Do we chase him from here or he chase him from above? What's that? Right in that saddle. Yeah, he's right in that saddle. He might have pitched down there last night. <laughs> every time. He's a jibbler. And now we head back to the truck. Back to the truck. And we drive around. <laughs> no problem. But the biggest issue I have with turkeys, um, they've been dealing with it for a couple decades now. They have wings and they fly these random places. They're supposed to come down here. We're going to kill them. They're not supposed to go that way. What are they, what are they, aren't they supposed to pitch downhill? <laughs> what are the chances we drive up there and then he gobbles from down here? Um, about a 50-50. Yeah, I was going to say about 60-40. <laughs> I can work with those odds. Well, he's there. It's also good odds we're going to drive through. He's going to be in the road. Just <laughs> so they're probably on the private. There are birds just firing off this morning. It's not, we have a lot of team indigestion. It's not doing well this morning. I forgot my TP. There's birds just firing off over and over again. We're gonna back the truck up, throw some stuff on our back, and uh, go kill one. Go, on, go kill two. I just heard a shotgun go off. <laughs> just shooting them out of the roost. It's probably just after legal light. I don't know. Let's go kill some birds. I'm psyched. Should I bring my pack? No. They're a ways down. That's good news for us. This way or go around at him. Well, it goes away from this for quite a little ways and then cuts back again. I'm worried that they're just gonna come over on the private and we're gonna miss them. Yeah, I think. Going down this fence line wouldn't be a bad thing. It gets flat again. That's where those other birds are. We're in the ballpark. We're in the ball game. <clears throat> gonna make this happen. Get Trevor Longbeard.
Oh my gosh. <gasps> We're tagged out. <laughs> Good job. That was cool hearing him going that scoop. drum, yeah. Boom. I've never heard that before. <laughs> Dude, I was so nervous right there. Yeah, what are we doing out in the middle of everywhere? And he has like, what, four yards before he goes on private? Yeah. Yes! Good job. Ah, oh, good job. <sighs> Thanks, Cody. Yeah. That was so fun. Let's go see what he is. <laughs> I didn't even get it. I didn't even check for the beard. We just, oh. as soon as that. Oh, it was a Tom. Long beard. beard. Is it? Oh, yeah. Yep, that Look at his head. Jello head. Well, you got jelloed. <laughs> Killed yourself a long beard. Yeah! I'm a long beard killer. <laughs> what, about 25 yard shot? Yep. Oh, I'm glad I didn't shoot those three and a half inch whatever they were yesterday. <laughs> My face is intact, no loose teeth. Like, no flop. <laughs> no, dead, dead. he was dead, dead. Dude, that's a great <laughs> So fun. Like That was fun. It, when I, it goes right, it feels, it's like, so easy you know well what i like is well the backstory that you guys don't know them probably didn't get shown in this video and all these videos is cody was out here the week before day after day waking up how many of you wake up in the morning way before daylight drive an hour hour and a half up into the mountains and then scout and call and look for sign and make waypoints and i mean a lot of days to make this look easy right you know so pretty awesome i appreciate it cody yeah oh look at that Ooh, fanny fanerson oh he's non-typical he's non-typical <laughs> look at that yeah i got a non-typical <laughs> <laughs> i only shoot drop tines and non-typical turkeys <laughs> Yeah, see, when, the perfect thing is yeah, he's gobbling on his own. You responded to him that one time, mm -hmm. he gobbled back. And then didn't say anything. Yeah, because otherwise, what what will happen a lot of times, he would just sit here and... Dance. Just, yeah, because their biology is for the hens to come to them. It's the opposite of like... Oh, and it's, I was so, so scared he was going to cross right here and then looking come. for a hen, and then we're going to be exposed, and then how do you call him back? Yeah. That's why oh, I'm so glad he didn't come like 20 yards that way. I wouldn't have had a shot. I wish we could have got to here just so we could have seen him for a little bit yeah. longer. I mean, you guys but saw like that much of his head and I was like, that's, you got him, Cody. But that's the thing, like hunting with a decoy, you set up on that spot where they come in and they're 25 yards and you kill them. Yeah. You know? So it's not like you got 60 yards that they got to close looking for where that hen's at. Yeah. But. Well... What time is it? I feel like we... 622 was the record yesterday. It's 632 right now. So <laughs> I think 630 we can call it. Six, yeah, 29. Yeah. Oh, these are the spurs everyone talks about. Yeah. Half inch. <laughs> First year Tom, Easy. two year old bird. Young bird, but. Dude, we need so Ooh. pretty. Yeah, I was like, oh, okay, that's really cool. I didn't get to hear that at all yesterday. All by himself, huh? Yeah. Okay, guys, we're tagged out. Um, Stretch. That was, that was the turkey hunt for me. Uh, we got a bunch of us going around trying to, well, they're going to spend probably all day trying to do what we just did in about 10 minutes. <laughs> Good work. Good Lord. Man, they're pretty. This is a lot prettier bird than the yesterday. <laughs> so guys, there was the, our little setup right at the little, base of those two little pine trees. A little rise. 
Yeah. Man, we ran. So we came down this fence line and we thought he was on the back side of this, this knob. And so we went to scoot around and when we located him, locate called him here, he heard that and he peeled over while we were working this way. And so we had to run back. <laughs> A little double back. But it actually worked out nice because right here, it's, it were really exposed. And right there, he had to come all this way and commit because this is so thick. Yeah. So in retrospect, it's pretty good. Yeah. I've been trying to learn how to carry these, Cody. Uh, opposite. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> he looks bigger this way. <laughs> he does. He does. Spring tag, we're going to validate it, right? Mm -hmm. Select the unit. So I'll select my unit. Top secret. And hit OK. And then it's a black screen. Well, there's this little tiny box right here that I'm supposed to select, which seems weird. And then once I have that box checked, then I just hit save. And it says, when online, you must sync your app within 90 days for this validation to be recorded. Because I'm in airplane mode. I hit OK. Boom. Confirmation.
Hell oh, yeah. I waited for him to get back. Dude, your head they're right right behind your head the entire time. I didn't care. I saw that and I wasn't waiting for the big ones. Dude, public land. Where was it two hens that were fighting right here? No, those are Jake's. Oh, because I saw them for like a split second. Nice calling, buddy. That was awesome. What a hunt. <laughs> that was awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. Dude. Good job. That, dude. That, was, that calling was Man. awesome. First, I wasn't waiting for He's the He's already one. plucked. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> that was a three and a half to the face. That was three dude. and a half just face so crushed. Cool. They went right under that. Side. I'm like, come under, come under. Did they come right under? Yeah, came right under. Oh. They went right under. Yeah. yeah. Dude, I was like, do I lean out the camera? I'm like, ah, oh. you're like, do you like, see him? Do you see him? I'm like, they're like, right behind his head. I wasn't going to shoot. Awesome. Once they come out, I was like, I want you to get him before. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Awesome. Looks like a freaking massacre. It was a massacre. Dude, did you see that thing freaking, that oh, three? Yeah. It was like, all right, I'm just going to build the excitement, build the excitement, and build the excitement. Like, I, I could hear the hen, and the big tongue was hanging, and then once they got right up oh, here, yeah. I could tell they were coming. I'm like, I'm not waiting, man. I'm, you could hear them drumming. Yeah. So we heard a bird down in here. Yep. yep. Is this a, di these were different birds? So these jakes were the ones that were long ways off. Way, they way off, the right? Way. They just kept coming, and then all of a sudden they got like that landing, and I was like, oh, they're, yeah. they're coming now. Yeah. Dude, that, that, pow, pow, pow. They just, every time, they that. just hammered it. Nice shot. That's. I was so glad you let him come, like right at the decoy. Oh, I was like, oh yeah, let him come. Because <laughs> <laughs> the one I shot was fighting with that other one back yeah. here. And I saw them like they were hopping around right here, huh? Yeah, and then when those two came up, they were just like, uh uh. And then I was like, I halfway expected to see a strutter just like come up like right. <laughs> well, and I was like, I was like, God, if he comes right up. And, Dude, that was perfect. Oh yeah. So that's, I thought they might be. Like, I saw heads like hopping around. Yeah, they, they were, were down there. It looked like one of them was messed up. I don't know if they were just jumping on each other or what they were doing. I saw beard, and it was like, oh yeah, I'm sending Game this freaking over. three and a half. I'm glad you. I'm glad you did wait for them to come. Oh, I was. Gonna, so, I mean, yeah. I knew like once they came through, they were gonna come. Yeah. I just wanted them to get. Through. Dude, that's cool. The shotgun just. Oh, yeah. I just was like eased into it. I haven't shot a three and a half out of this yet, Trent. Trent did. <laughs> Shoot. Look at his face. He's got blood on his face. <laughs> <while> <laughs> attacking <laughs> that turkey. Dude, that turkey. God. It looks like a freaking massacre. What was cool was like sitting down. I was like, okay, there's two ways of playing this. We're going to like slow play. Yeah. Like, or just here's the party. Yeah. And as soon as I started going, I was like, well, they're they're amping up. Yeah, they you know? Yeah. It was cool. And they'd pause for a minute and then boom, they'd start firing yeah. back up. I was it's like, crazy how, how they like yeah. over the course of. 15 minutes how much fire like how, how oh fire my gosh yeah, yeah those birds covered 
because they were the further ones. They were the long ones. Yeah. They covered a lot. This long beard is the one that we first called to. Yes. He's got hands. Yeah. yeah. I could hear that hand. Like, there was one time oh, he yeah. must have been, like, right there. I think he was right down here. Yeah. yeah. And then I heard her, and I thought, he might, she might come in. But... Well, I just, I just kept hearing, mm. yeah, like, I could he's hear getting closer, yeah. you know? I thought at one point that there was birds down in here. I did, too. Because I heard, ch -ch -ch -ch. Yeah. yeah, and then I thought I'd hear, like, scratching yeah. in the leaves. And you know what's cool? Just we can walk right up the road. Yeah. Got to get a picture somewhere. Oh, yeah. absolutely. In the sun and the yeah. scrub oak. Yeah. That'd be beautiful. Right up there somewhere would be pretty cool with those trees. Yeah. Some pine. Yeah. Yeah. If, if, we if we were on that side, I think we'd call more birds up, but I don't think they're going to come back up here. No. no. <laughs> well, they're going to like when they come to check on this. Like, you're never allowed to cross that fence ever again. <laughs> <laughs> I see you want half your fan. <laughs> I heard them that one time far off, and then when I heard them closer, I was like, yeah, they're, they're well, definitely you, 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 you picked it out. We were on that other ridge. You're like, they're on that other ridge, and they're on the down slope of it. And sure enough, we get over here, and it's like, yeah. they're right there. Yeah, yeah that just, was perfect. I yeah. think they just rolled around that face. Yep. And then, yeah, they're, they're on this little knob or something. Yeah. The private comes up and then cuts back in, yeah. right? And, yep. Yeah. Yep. And, mm -hmm. yep. Like you said, we could have probably kept working the line. Uh-huh. But, I mean, I don't know with the big one here. And that other hand, they were eventually gonna. If you don't have Onyx in your turkey hunting, you're doing yes. a great disservice to yourself. Yes, <laughs> we wouldn't have killed that bird without Onyx. No way, no, without Onyx, no way. No, no, it was very helpful. Yeah, you would have spent a lot of time just wandering around, yeah, trying to figure out the lay of the land. That was fun, man. I'm awesome. glad we got to do it. Oh, yeah, good job, super Steve. excited. That was awesome. Sure. The old hand cannon over here, the, the old, the old three and a half, dude. <laughs> Freaking <laughs> Jesus. The gun was gonna I thought I was going to catch it. <laughs> oh, I was just like eased into it. I, I mean, I was like hardly even holding on to it. Dude, that thing squeezed off and I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> She's got some kick. <laughs> Brown tail. Dude, nice. Let's look for the match. That is a deer bull. That is a stud. That looks fake for a second. I looked up there and I saw an elk track and I was like, oh, there's elk around here. And then he's just like, yes. That is a freshie. Yeah, that is a freshie. All right, so we've had Incredible morning. Incredible morning. It's been really awesome. good. Steve hammered to Jake. That experience was awesome. Birds came up off the private. Just, just great turkey Perfect. hunt. Came over here. Came a couple spots. Yeah, hit a couple spots. Nothing. Nothing. Came down here. Hiked way down in here, thinking, well, maybe no one's been here, and weren't having any luck. In the last spot, we checked. Shot gobble. Got a bird shot gobble, and then uh, hunted him. Yeah. Didn't realize he had hens. Yeah. And he was not coming, so we yeah. tried making a move on him. Bumped into this, which is pretty awesome. <laughs> pretty awesome. <laughs> and. Uh, Decided we ended up seeing him and a couple of hens strutting across that meadow. Uh, it's getting pretty hot out, and we're like, you know what? Let's just back out and roost them tonight. Come back in the morning. They're they're living on this road system, yeah. so a lot of scat. I think we can intercept them somehow. Yeah, but, it was awesome. Dude, awesome was great, morning. Great morning. It was fun. And it's it's getting hot out. It's very hot. <laughs> hot. So we got some exciting times. First bear. I'm getting a little teared up. I'm sorry, guys. First bear of the season. First bear of the season. So, oh man, it has been a long, hard fight. Obviously, it's well, okay, it's only been a week and a half or so, but just haven't seen one yet. But clear across here, it's in the phone scope. It's um. Uh, so uh, he uh, Troy opted to pass because the bear is sitting at 1,981 yards right now. So right here, we got some phone scope for you guys. Check. Oh, look at him here. It's an important bear right there. But super slow feeding, like he hasn't moved. Probably, I would say, at least 20 yards. Not even maybe. 20, I don't think. Yeah. yeah, and so from seeing him, so. Anyway, 
yeah, it's not super exciting, but it's exciting for us because we finally saw one. So, well, he doesn't look that big. It looks like a really small bear to me. Even at that range, it doesn't, it doesn't have any size, but we'll keep at it here. We're going to hunt the turkey birds in the morning, I believe. Uh, Cody and Strain are out roosting right now. So I think we're just going to, it's almost dark, close this video out for today. Guys, this has been a crazy trip. A lot of birds down, finally a bear spotted. Um, Troy's jacked up, as you can tell. <laughs> I'm like just excited to see a bear. Yeah. So anyway, good night, guys. Tomorrow's a new day. It's our last day on this trip, and hopefully we can run into some more gobblers and maybe even hopefully cap off this bear trip at some point. So thank you guys for watching this one. We'll see you in the morning.